Badger fans instead of band members filled the band section in Camp Randall Saturday as the Wisconsin band was suspended from performance due to hazing allegations, band director Mike LeCrone announced Friday. UW Dean Lori Burkholm said the university is currently conducting an investigation into the hazing, which LeCrone said entailed alcohol abuse and inappropriate sexual behavior. Officials would not confirm where the allegations came from. Uh, there's some allegations of hazing, which I find totally unacceptable. I, I, the band knows it, and uh, I feel like this is, a, this is the main step we can do to, to uh, do to make them understand that uh, we're very serious about this. I think we've made great strides. With the band missing, UW students said there was something missing at Camp Randall Saturday. Yeah, I don't know. It wasn't very, it wasn't as much fun. Like it was still fun because the game was, it was huge, but I don't know, it felt like something was missing. And I thought it really sort of detracted from like the whole experience of being a student going to the game. I mean, yeah. like, halftime sucks. Just sitting there, like, watching the big screen as the like, sports news report came up. Um, I mean, obviously it was sad, like, it's a big game. But I think it would have helped a lot in the student section and all sports they were there. But, uh, I don't know. I mean, like, I heard, I heard it was about hate teams. I guess it was deserved. I kind of wish I, I think everyone wishes they were there. LeCrone said the band will practice on Tuesday, but a performance in next Saturday's game against Penn State is still undetermined. And as I said, they were violated. It's my belief.